What's going on, everybody? It's our Pod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. And I'm here to let you guys know about SGM Podcast Episode 6. Yes, we dropped another episode on iTunes, on Podomatic. And we dropped it on, you know, another little thing that I would call Stitcher Radio. But I'm just here to get you guys up to date on what we talked about in this podcast. Now, I know you can already tell from the title. I know you came here to listen to some crazy voicemails of guys and stuff like that. But I want to do is I want to redirect you guys to iTunes. All you got to do is go search SGM and our podcast should be the first search that pops up. You can also go to Podomatic and search SGM. And inside the description of this video is all the links that you will need. So you can hurry up and go listen to them crazy voicemails. Also inside the title is Grand Theft Auto 5. We dropped a couple details, our thoughts on the game when it drops, what we will be playing. Me and my boy up for discussion. We be going in all the time on these SGM podcasts. And I know that you guys would definitely feel these things. All you got to do is give it a chance. I know I usually don't ask you guys to watch and like and favorite and subscribe and all this nonsense. But look. When it comes to this SGM podcast, this right here is something molded from the ground up. We put a lot of work into it. So please, if you can go over to iTunes, subscribe to the podcast, leave a five-star review and your thoughts on our recent podcast every week, all week, it would be highly appreciated, man. Also, go on the Podomatic, click the um, website in the description, definitely go over there, uh, leave it a like, a comment, or whatever your thoughts. We also got a voicemail popping. I don't know if um, too many people saw last week we got a voicemail where you guys can actually leave your thoughts on this actual podcast. So what I want you guys to do is pull your phones out right now. I'm going to give you a second, even though your phone should be right next to to you. (laughs) So what I want you to do is type in 313-744-3766. Store that number in your phone as SGM underscore podcast, or you can just store it as iPod King Carter or up for discussion. And when you listen to our podcast, all you got to do is drop a voicemail. They are highly appreciated. We do put them in our podcast. <laughs> it, yo, a couple of these joints do be funny, man. I will say that. But uh, let me give you guys what we went over this week. When we went over our weekly blitz, which is some like a, a little betting, a man's bet between me and Jay with, you know, who's going to win in the NFL week by week. We also want to go over with the Falcons going undefeated uh, thing that we had last week. We were totally wrong, and we have the voicemails to prove it. Um, we also went over Mike Brown in the Lakers situation with Dan Tony. Um, we also went over a little bit of things about the UFC. Uh, like I said, Grand Theft Auto 5, Black Ops 2, we talked about that as well. We also talked about our cash and pass for the week. Cash or pass is basically something like if we're going to go out and buy an album or if we're going to pass on that album for the uh, download or something like that. And this week it was Neo's Red new album. And we even talked about the game. I don't know if too many people know about the game, but he's a recording artist and he might be getting signed with MMG soon. But hey i'm i'm <laughs> the video i'm gonna leave you a nice little snippet um we also got some banging tracks in this joint so it's not just gonna be us talking the whole time you're actually gonna be listening to some banging tracks but with that being said this gameplay is me wiser now and smalls 99 and here goes a snippet of the sgm podcast y'all so let's get into it what we're gonna be talking about this week carter um the first topic to me gotta be grand theft auto 5 right yes sir now in the recent days that just passed grand theft auto just released a new trailer now i know a lot of people have been waiting on news pictures trailers info info news trailers pictures like it seems like rockstar does not want to give up the cookie like no matter how they never do though, man. yo, no matter how you think about it, you just gotta think like this. Okay, Rockstar is coming out with a new game. Let me mark it in my calendar. I don't even want to know nothing about the game. I'll just figure it out when I get it. Because if you have any type of anticipation, you know, you know what Rockstar is, right? Rockstar yeah. is that fine ass chick that <laughs> act like she gonna give you the cool, but all she gonna do is work her palms, be that. That's it. That, yeah. That's all. You, that's all she gonna do for you, man. To give you a little bit you might get one off but you're not gonna get the cool you're not gonna touch the cool sniff the cool nothing yo it's it's crazy man but <laughs> did you did you see the trailer because i saw it probably about three or four times i had to keep re-watching it i saw it sir i saw it you know what i'm saying i watched it in 360 i watched 480 
I watched it in 720p. I, I even rendered a version for myself for 1080. Like I was, I was drawn. I See, was. I, I'm embarrassed to say how I watched it, so we just gonna rock off with how you watched it. All right, well, since you just watched it for yourself on the school, we ain't gonna worry exactly. about it. Exactly. <laughs> you, you, you knew that. You knew that before I even said that. Yes, yes. <laughs> but so far, Grand Theft Auto Five is looking good. Um, I watched a couple of regular Dave um, 2975 videos on YouTube, and he actually gave me a little bit of info on what type of setup they're going to have this year. It's not just going to be one character, you know, of being like a, some type of lackey. Like, you know, in all the Grand Theft Autos, you're always doing missions for some guy. Oh. Um, you know what I'm saying? You a bum, you in the streets, you gotta build your rep up, you still don't even become the head honcho at the end of the game, you end up killing somebody else. Like, it always gets crazy. But this year, I heard that you can beat any three players at any specific time. Yes, like, sir. you can be. It's like a movie, son. <laughs> exactly. Like, you can be the, the top dog, you can be the, the black boy, you can be the, uh, I wouldn't say redneck, but more like like enforcer Method. type dude. Method. Method. Right. Method. That, that's yeah. how we, you know, describe that type of person in the population. <laughs> meth hat. <laughs> All right, or meth head. You know what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying? You can be any type of the, of those characters at any given time you want. So you don't have to just be one person. I kind of like that. You know what I'm yeah. saying? If I want to, if I, and this game, the, and the sorry thing about it is. I know for a fact that this is going to be one of those games that everybody will be using in the YouTube community because mm -hmm. the way that a lot of people make their videos. Hey, and big ups to the homeboy Azure Effect, man, because, yo, he started that whole shit, dog. Like, yeah. I don't care what nobody say, man. Like, Azure started the storylines behind the videos and niggas just ran with that shit. I mean, niggas doing some creative shit with it, but, yo, big ups to the homie Azure, man. Yeah, but definitely, this is definitely going to be one of those games where a guy is definitely going to make a crazy storyline out of this game because it's not just one character. You you don't have to subject yourself to having, you know, uh, brown skin fingers while you drive into the game, but you have a Caucasian my player or something like that. This time you can, <laughs> like this this is real rap. Like you can you can be anybody you want to be. The storylines are going to be great. You can even take action scenes from the game. Like you can record. The whole time you're playing Grand Theft Auto and take cutscenes and make it look like you're on your way to the game, you're doing something else, you're going out on a date. You can do so much with the game. That's why when I get it, I'm going to think about it if I want to do it. You know, usually yeah. the way I make my 2K videos, I just make straight basketball. You know what I'm saying? I know guys really didn't come there to see me and take a check out to dinner before the week before the game and all of that. So what I do is I just do straight basketball. But if I ask the fans do they want it and they say, yeah, I might throw them a couple of drinks like that. But for now, me, myself, Grand Theft Auto 5 is going to be one of those games where, man, I will actually pick up my council and take it inside my son's room, right outside of my bedroom. I would tell my girl, tell my son, like, listen, look, I'm going to be locked away for about a day. I don't want no food. I don't want no drink. This man said a day. No yeah. food. <laughs> no food, no drink, man. I'm going to end up playing this whole game, recording all of it. My Mac will probably run out of storage space and everything. Like, I would just be going in. You know what I'm saying? Like, GTA has always been one of those games where you just can't stop playing it. You know, it's like NBA 2K13 Blacktop. When I'm playing Blacktop, and I'll say, yo, I'm going to play five games real quick, get a little bit of VC, and then then go chill, turn my system off. Five games turn into 25 games. That's just how 2K is. When you play GTA, you think you're going to do about three missions, brother, please. you going to sit up there and do about 30 missions. You're going to be probably 45% into the game already because you know it's going to show you the percentages when you're done. You're like, damn, 23%? No, 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 I need more, I need more, I need to, I need to finish it. <laughs> like, that's just how the, that game has always been for me. Grand Theft Auto has always been an outlet for me to, because I, I like storyline games, you know, I want to know what's next. You know what I'm saying? I want to know if I snipe this dude head off, am I going to end up a billionaire, or if I choose not to kill him, am I going to be in the slums? You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I love Grand Theft Auto and how they have different scenarios for dish, different options in the game. Like, GTA 4 was a beast as game like when you choose certain situations and it'll take you down a different path is crazy like i can't i can't wait to get the game dog i'm sitting over here on pins and needles just listening to you talking trying not to cut you off dog because my god dog the choir is singing over here for me man because 
everything that you're saying, I can totally relate, man. I've been a fan of GTA. It's been my favorite game. I used to play it when it was a top-down joint, man. How many people play GTA when it was top-down, man? I'm talking GTA 2 on the PlayStation. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But nah, man. I am <laughs> hella excited for this you game. Over and you go splat. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dog. That was the shit, man. But nah, like, this is the thing. I, I really enjoyed GTA 4 when I got it. I loved it. But it kind of... It kind of, you know, became a little mundane for me. You know, I did get do. I can't remember what that first pack was where you was a biker, and but I didn't get no other other the add-on packs. But I'm really excited about GTA 5, man. I really like the fact that they going with the trifecta dog. We get to have three different characters. That's new. That's the thing you gotta love and respect about GTA and Rockstar Games, man. They always looking to you know break the mold they always trying to be an a innovator man they never trying to be chasing behind people man 2k sports take notice man because y'all don't want to become mundane you got to be innovative like rockstar they keep bringing it to us brand new and fresh and i think having three characters that you can simultaneously and just whenever you want just jump in between different characters that's amazing dog they all three different you got a young dude you got an old dude and you got a fucking meth head I mean, that is freaking amazing. And the fact that I heard you can do not just solo missions now, but they saying you could do the solo missions, you could do tag team missions where maybe it's just two of the dudes and you can switch between them, or you got the big joint, all three guys in the same mission at the same time, and you could pick between which dude you want to play as, man. I think that's crazy. After watching the trailers, the cars look fucking sick, man. I was looking at the cars like, damn, dog, I can't wait to drive that. Can't wait to steal that shit. So, yeah, man, I'm hella excited about it. I can't wait till they start showing off some of the guns, man, because you know they always bring crazy guns, crazy explosives. So, yeah, man, I'm excited about GTA 5, man. No question. Okay, okay. Are, are you good? Because um, that, that felt I'm good, man. <laughs> I'm good, all right. Woosa. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, um, I guess that's the end of the GTA 5 details. Let's move into another gaming topic, a game that just was recently released not too long ago, a few days ago, actually. Let's talk about Black Ops 2. 